Hi guys, this is Megan with the blog WilsonHomestead.com and today we are back with another cloth diaper video review. Today we are reviewing the Bebe Boo cloth diaper. I always like to let you guys know up front that this video is sponsored, but it in no way changes my opinion of these cloth diapers. I always give honest reviews and I always and I only recommend things to you guys that my family actually loves and uses. So I would never give a false review just because it's sponsored. So this video is gonna have all the things that I like and don't like about the Baby Boo cloth diaper. So let's get right into this. So Green Maternity was so kind to send me this diaper along with a few other ones that I'm reviewing. These are all diapers that I would review anyway because I like to give you guys an idea of which diapers I like, which ones are really high quality, and which ones I think you should buy. So I will link this exact cloth diaper down in the description box so you guys can go check it out yourselves. So this is the cloth diaper she sent me. This print on, on the website is called Home. So if you want this exact print, that's the selection, that's the one you'd select to have to get this print. So it has all kinds of animals, and sea creatures, and it's really cute. So this diaper is for 10 to 35 pounds. So this will fit from basically a little bit bigger than a newborn until they're potty trained. This will fit a really big child. I actually don't even think that my three-year-old is 35 pounds yet, so it would still fit on her. It is $14.95 on her website, so that's not a bad price for this brand. So for this size, it's considered an all-in-one size because you can fit from almost a newborn to their potty trained, which is really nice. I really love all-in-one sizes because you can lose, use them so long. You can get a really customized fit with the three rise settings. So you can see here there's one, two, three settings. You can fold this one down and snap it in to any setting you need to make it smaller. So that helps it be really customizable to your baby size. So it also has a double row of snaps around their waist, which you guys know I really like the double row. If it's only a single row, it's harder to get the fit right around their hips. You can have more leaking around their little chubby legs. So I really like the double setting. It has three snaps on the wing here. So you take this around, you take this around and you can put one here if your baby's got a bigger belly than they do leg. I would put this one here and then you can bring this one back like this and have it on a different setting. So then you can have more room for your baby's leg or you can do it opposite. You can have this one back further. So you don't, they don't have to be exactly up and down. You can have them more adjusted to your baby's exact size, which I really, really like about this. So this has a front panel along the tummy here. So this helps with wicking if you have a tummy sleeper. So if this material were to come all the way up to the top like this to here, it could leak in the front. So if they lay on their belly, it could leak right onto their pajamas or onto the sheets or whatever. So this panel here is really important to prevent wicking. This is part of the waterproof material, so it'll help keep all the liquid down lower. <laughs> so this is important again for tummy sleepers or for boys because they pee more in the front. So these have single gusset on the legs, which I generally prefer double gussets. So that is one thing that I would prefer different about this cloth diaper. But the single gussets do feel like they're really high quality elastic, which is really important if you have only a single gusset. So you can see it's still really stretchy, even though I've washed this diaper and used it a whole bunch. Sometimes with really cheaply made diapers, it can already be like wearing out. It's really surprising how fast elastics can go bad on cloth diapers if you don't get a good brand, but this one feels really good. So it also has some elastic on the back here. So this has a two pocket design. So this is a pocket diaper, but it has an opening in the back and it has an opening in the front. Now, I will be honest with you, I don't love the double pocket design. That's one thing that I don't love about this diaper either. I really like it when the top is closed because it seems like the inserts can kind of like make this flap open a little bit and stick out the front. I like it when there's a hard edge, they can't go any further than this. So in general, I look for ones that are closed on the top here, but it is nice because the, this is really big. So sometimes I have a hard time getting my hand in ones that are really tight elastic that are only on the back, but this is huge. So there's like, I can fit my entire arm in here. So that is one thing that I do like about the double pockets. It just really depends on personal preference. I'm just letting you guys know why I don't like the two pockets, but some people like them even better. So it just depends on your personal preference. 
The other nice thing about having double pockets like this is you don't have to take the inserts out when you put them in the washer. They will just agitate out during the wash cycle. So this pocket is so big and there's the opening on the end so the, the inserts will just come right out of there. So one less step for busy parents, which is a really big plus. As long as you don't snap it in on, on both sides. So if you snap it in, obviously it won't come out, but you leave it, I generally just leave them unsnapped and they come right on out in the wash so I don't have to remember to unpack it before I put it in there, which is really nice. It's lined with soft athletic wicking jersey. It's stain resistant, lightweight, it's cooler in the summer, and it also does a really good job wicking away the moisture from your baby's skin. So less rashes, less for, for feeling of wet uncomfortableness on their bottoms. So they can last longer at night if you have something that's got a really good wicking material on it because they won't feel wet. So these are the two inserts that I have with it. One is bigger and one is smaller. And what I really like about this one is it has these adjustable snaps. So I can snap this down when she was littler. I would snap this down and put it with a smaller one like this. And then I stuff both of these inside. And obviously I'd have this adjusted like all the way down to the lowest rise setting so that it was a lot smaller. So, and then both of these actually have a snap right here so that you can snap it into the diaper and it'll stay on there. So if you're too busy to pack your diaper, I really like using these snap options. So you can just lay it right on top of the diaper, lay it on top, snap it in. Oh, that's a good snap. And then, and then just have it lay on top and you put it over your baby like this. So you don't have to pack it inside. I really like that option on these diapers as well. The snaps feel decently high quality. They're not as high quality as some of the other cloth diapers that I've used. Some of them feel like they don't snap in as securely as I would like. So they might not last through as many kids because the snaps might wear out a little bit, but they do feel they do feel pretty good. I've, I've had some, some brands of snaps where they just will not stick in at all. It's really, really bad. So these feel like they're probably in the like midway. They're not super high quality, but they're not like really, they're not really poorly made. So just one thing to keep in mind is I don't love the snap quality. So to sum up, I do really like this diaper. It's really cute. It's a nice quality. It works really well. It's really, really adjustable. You can use it from 10 pounds, which is only a couple pounds more than my first two babies were born at. So they were able to wear these pretty quickly. So. And then it goes all the way to 35 pounds, which is really a lot for a toddler. So it'll go all the way to pie training, which I really like about this. So it's an all-in-one size. So I do think this diaper is a really good option for you. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that review and now you guys have all the information for yourselves. You guys can decide whether or not you wanna get this brand or not. Again, I will link this down in the description box, the link to this, and thank you for watching this video. I will see you in the next one. Bye.